Hi, I'm Pamela McGee, and you're watching Mommy Noir. Well, basically, um, we have a videographer who videotapes everything, you know, just for our family archives. Well, she, she put together maybe a two-minute sizzle, and she, she showed it to one of her friends, and he says, you know what, I got a development deal with Sony. So um, Holly Jacobs, who is the president of um, Sony, she said, you know, Pamela, your story is so unique and it's so powerful. You know, as a female, women need to see this story. Not only African-American women, but, you know, I call Holly my vanilla sister from another mother. She says, white women need to see another image of a strong female. So, so Mom's Got Game is more about, we always say, we're not trophy chicks. We can be trophy chicks, but we're chicks with trophies. <laughs> The relationship with my son is what they saw and what you'll see in the show. You know, with my son, he's, his, his motto was always, Ma, you good? You know, I got you, Ma. That's what he's always said, through breast cancer, through a horrific divorce. He's always been, Ma, you all right? I got you. And so um, when you see that on the show, that's just our lives. I mean, I never imagined that my son would be in the NBA. He'll tell you that. Uh, he would always say, yeah, I was probably his worst critic. I said, you want to get paid to play? That's what we call his profession. You want to get paid to play? Oh, no, bro, you got to bring it. The most challenging part of being both business manager and mother is at the end of the day, I have to make sure that he protects his capital, that he maximizes his investments, and that the choices he make will be long-term choices and that they will both benefit his, his, his legacy and create generational wealth. That's what I have to do as a business manager. Now, as a mother, I have to make sure that allow him to make mistakes. And so that's probably the hardest part, to let him do his thing and be okay with it. Because he's a man at the end of the day. And sometimes at the end of the day, even as wives, as lovers, we have to allow our men to be men and sit back and say, because he's a man, you still knew I was right. <laughs> Just, it's a fun show and that makes sure that we need to tune in. Because at the end of the day, if we don't get numbers, we won't see this kind of positive programming. So we need to show up and you put the word out to tune in. Because at the end of the day, we have to have positive programming in order to get a second season and continue to see programming like this. So it's not enough for you to just say, oh, I like the show. It's more enough to tell your mother, your brother, your sister, your cousin, whatever, and tune in.